what else could be innovation? What would be maybe some other ideas of what do you think innovation? You coming in from the academic world to TDOT, what could be some ideas for innovation? They are some of the newest of the new at TDOT, Graduate Transportation Associates, or GTAs. These new civil engineers could be a big part of the future of engineering at TDOT. And if you do a good job, you will shine, period. You will. Cream rises to the top. Today they will face a unique challenge, not with concrete and steel, but with spaghetti and a marshmallow. Go! 18 minutes. To be sure, this is not a normal day. Have you ever done this? But an important early step. The goal at the end was to be able to put a large marshmallow on top of it without it falling. Does it help stiffen it? Using the supplies available, they go to work. But the real lesson here is not culinary construction. Everyone in here is brand new, and some of them know each other from school, but I, it's a really good communication and, um, and how to understand how people work and how their personalities work and how socially they are with each other. Working as a team is the underlying lesson, a skill that is a struggle for many young engineers. Teamwork. I mean, I came up with the original idea and then they all pitched in different ideas to help keep it stable and make it even higher than what we originally planned. Pressure is added to see what these engineers can cook up. You're making me nervous. <laughs> <laughs> so far I think they're pretty good. It's interesting that I just told them six minutes and as soon as I said six minutes everyone's brain started really rushing and so that's what the whole strategy of the game is and we'll, we'll see here in a minute of how it all works in the teamwork of, of how your brain processes for the whole 18 minutes. Pressure, guys. 30 seconds. When time's up, two of the four groups have a standing structure. We were semi-successful. <laughs> what I mean by that is um, our object was standing up until the time expired and then decided to fall down before people could see it. It's challenging and it's always interesting working with people and seeing what they, they come up with and trying to make stuff work. But every group has experienced the value of working together. Overall, I think everyone did really well. It was it, the the bottom line. It was interesting to see all of them communicate. And as most engineers are very quiet and reserved, but when it, they all had this common goal to you know really work and build the biggest structure. Over the next year, these GTAs will contribute to real world projects an opportunity many new engineers don't get so early in their careers. The second day I was there, I was helping someone with a project uh, resurfacing a road, and so that'll be implemented within the next couple months. So it's just nice to see something that you worked on and then it gets implemented in the real world. A real world that is not topped off by marshmallows. I guess the last thing I have to say is thank you for coming to work for TDOT. I think we got a lot of clear eyes in the room. TDOT's Graduate Transportation Associate Program is a great way for entry-level civil engineers to earn real-world experience working on actual TDOT projects. There are a number of benefits to being in the program. You can learn more at this website.